All right. Now we change the default icon of an application in Ubuntu. And uh, the application I want to change is of this one. It's uh, PC Man FM. And uh, I want to change the icon because actually it looks like the one is uh, of um, Dolphin, which is the default uh, uh, file manager that Ubuntu uh, shipped with. So we, I have to do in this way. I go to home, to the root directory. Sorry, so it's uh, USR, then share, and the one that we're going to see is applications. Here are all the configuration files, which are the desktop files, and uh, where are specified a number of uh, directives for the for the application for the relative application. And uh, among these directives, there is uh, the uh, icon specification for uh, the application. So let's see now how we can change the icon as we want. Uh, the first thing I want to do is actually to uh, run terminal and uh, do a sudo. And uh, I open get it. Uh, get Okay, and uh, in this way, I want to open this file because the, actually the desktop file is our text file, uh, nothing but text files. So I'm going to open the uh, um, text file, this uh, application, and there we go. It was a USR share application applications and now we see now that uh, the same we got here with the icons in uh, in uh, get it we have the the same name but with a station desktop which doesn't appear here so now we open the fm uh fg we go up um File manager, PC man. Okay, here it is. We open it. All right, so now we see that now there is the icon specified. It's just the generic icon, which is a system file manager. That's why it's the same as the uh, Dolphin one. So I want to change. In order to change now, we are to, uh, to find a new icon. To do that, open the browser. Go. I used to open a private window. And uh, the one I like, um, I found that this quite good icon is uh, freeicons.io. And I go there. And I do it a folder, and uh, I like to see to choose one one is actually different from uh, the usual one. I like maybe this one is looks good, and uh, uh, the one I'm going to choose is uh, this one is too small. More than this 128 by 128 pixel. I download as a PNG. Oh, okay. Now I I have to specify uh, the load place because then I have to uh, indicate the place where I uh, going to store this uh, to save this uh, this icon. So what I'm going to save is uh, first of all I'm going to change also the name, of course, it's because this one is not. Uh, it's not uh, very very user friendly, so I go there and um, instead of download. Okay, now I have to put on download. So if a new new uh, okay, let's go FM icon. It's okay, right? I do in download. Now I go back to download and. Uh, Okay, open another, another tab and I go to my home folder, download, 
Download. Here it is. So now my icon is in the new FM icon in the share local share directory. I copy this and then I go back to my desktop file, which is PC man FM desktop. I want to actually to uh, yeah, comment this this line so. It's still there, but it's not taken into consideration by the system. So I do the same icon, then I specify the uh, the path and the name of the, of the file, which is I'm going to copy, just not to make typos or uh, something that maybe is not good for the system to understand which one to take. So I do save now. Uh, okay, See, now since everything is uh, working, in order to verify that, we go here, and now we see that the file manager has a new icon, but uh, in order to uh, to see also in the taskbar here, we have to close all the the instances of the, of the file manager, and uh, so we go back now. Uh, Okay, close also this one, and uh, we can close also this, no problem. And now open it back again, file manager, and now we have my, with the, we our PC man FM with the new icon. Well, it looks good. It's quite different from the other one, yes, of course. Okay, that's it. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.